Hug says we're back. What does the cow say? Probably the same thing. Have the boomerang equipped, yes. Yeah. Alright, we've got to get Medea back. So we have to give Red what she wants. That means we have to beat. I think it's trap bags. And I think it's probably the longest dungeon that we've encountered thus far. Would be the upcoming one. I think we'll just go to Reds, and then we'll go to the dungeon. I think you can go to the dungeon just straight away, and then go to Reds. Zingas. Yeah, two fisticuffs. Maybe that was a mistake. But I always do courage. Maybe we should. Okay, Booma might be the the third. Especially, well. I don't know. I don't think about it. of the Headhunter Kingdom, that shield. Somebody making a face. later Dragon Quest. Which witch is which? The witch of which there is no witcher? Hoods. So apparently Robin Hood, the tail, goes back to 
goes back over 800 years. Didn't know that. Impressive. Most impressive. Uh, trap box is gonna get annihilated unless it can defeat us, as in using defeat, or beat, whatever, if it has it. Alright, that's gonna be reds. And the dungeon is gonna be to the north. There's another place to the north. Let's talk to Red. Angus is gonna have to swallow his pride. Destroy his ego. Red's gotta be pretty tough living out here. Just her and, you know, one of these cronies. Don't you know I, I'm not using magic? still have a leather shield. Wow. I need to speak with Red. You're gonna have to let us through. Yangus, you think Red's gonna want to see your ugly muss? Oh, get out of here. Hop it. Hop it. <laughs> Don't you boss me around, mate. I ain't going nowhere till I see Red. So shift, Skivvy. Skivvy? Who the hell do you think you are? What does that even mean? Skivvy? Skivvy? It's not good. What's all the noise? I can hear your gabbing from in here. Gabbo? Gabbo! We'll take Gabbo in the party. Not oh, a problem. Sorry, boss. I got some geezer with no manners out here. He'll be gone in a mo. It's Yangus, isn't it? Just let him in. I'll speak to him myself. You were the boss. Go on. Inside with you. Guy sounds defeated. Uh, are we going to be able to steal from Red? Not now. Huh. Yeah, we'll, we'll go chat with Red later. So we need the ultimate key. We get that from Marta. Much, much, much later. Yeah, Red's gonna like this. We just go in her bedroom.
right? Oh, Venus tier. That's what we go and get in the dungeon, the Venus tier. World map. Don't often see your face round these parts anymore, Yangus. So, what brings you here? It's like this, Red. You bought an horse from the Black Market Drum in Pickham, right? Well, it belongs to this bloke I'm travelling with, see? Someone pinched it off him and then sold it on. That's how it came to be in the shop. I ain't gonna beat around the bush. I need it back. I'll pay whatever you want for it. Name your price. Straight up as usual, eh, Angus? I like that about you. It's nice with the rocking chair sound effect. I never really noticed that before. She's just very patient. But I'm not selling that horse. She's a quality mare. Toes the line and she's got a decent coat on her. You know how much I like quality. However much you're willing to pay, I am not parting with it. What? Not for nothing? Look, it ain't for me. It's for me mate. I've got to get her back. I'll do anything you want. Oh, interesting. Never thought I'd hear words like that coming out of your mouth. Must be a good mate, eh? So it goes from pay anything to do anything. All right, then. Here's what you're going to do. I'm sure you haven't forgotten the cave just north of here, right? Right. Just bring us the jewel that's hidden in there. You know, the Venus tear. Not a problem. What? Not that. You know I've been in that cave before and... Yeah, I guess. You just said you'd do anything I want. You're gonna welch on that now, are ya? Welch? Just bring us the Venus tear. Then I'll think about the oars. Off we go. Is this the dungeon where you have to Make walls go up and down, get to the back area kind of thing. I think so. Should be no problem. Encounter wise, so. Trap box is a mimic. Cannibals, you know, some boss mimic. And I think hits really hard. Right? Alright, so it's the north. The notorious north side. That was awesome. Not bad. Plus a drop, even better. Thank you.
the map also. So how difficult can it be? Yeah, so we have to get there. There's the chest. The Venus tier is supposed to be locked away in that. Must be a real gem. This ain't the first time I've had a bash at this place. I ain't never managed to get as far as the chest, mind. Yeah, but now you're rolling with... us. But I ain't doing the odd without it this time. We're gonna get that Venus tear. Hmm, we might have to move a statue or something like that. Goodie bags! Nice. We're gonna need some money. Because we've got Ar Argonia's coming up at some point. I don't know when. But we're going to need a t all the money we can get without selling anything. Because I might need a craft. Okay, sword. Not mummy boys, mummies. No problem. We've got a zillion herbs. So we've got about three dozen. Plenty. Plus... Superior medicine. Box of well, it's a dead box made out of wood. Yeah, thanks for storing that. Who puts cow crap in a pot? Well, an adventurer like us would. These split. Oh, do these just, they just sit there and they don't do anything, right? Place has a name, that's right. Swordsman's Labyrinth. Have a looky. Level three. Thank you. Easy money. It's a good movie.
was tough to hit. Oh no, we just got an equipment upgrade in Pick'em, so we can't use the turret. Flying crit was a nice effect. Hang on, am I completely turned around here? Shut, not open. Right. Well, they throw the numbers at you in here.
I didn't just do that, did I? Ooh. This time, let's look where we're going. Gotta be shitting me. Again? Wow. This game is really making me look silly right now. 
Well, shoot. Um, we'll go back up and check the far door, and probably it's gonna, I don't know. Who knows? Perhaps we should do some healing. Throwing a Yangus heal for Jess. Good. For now. Good thing there's no fall damage, because I keep falling down that hole. Yeah. Well, at least we're gonna get paid for it. You're not going to fool me this time. So you go through the door with the flames. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Uh, do I want to head this way? Let's go clear this level. Let's go back and check that other door. Watch the get slip and fall through the hole.
Neko no Tate. That would be Cat Shield. Neko chan no Tate. Angelo or Jessica? I think we have to give it to Jessica. What? Plus 10, plus 20? It's insane. Whoa. Now that's a level. Assassin. Serious Slicer. Stabaroo. Gorgeous. Gorgeous is in Dragon Warrior 7. That's where the Leafens live. Well, some of them. The ones on the uh, land. 12 gold, don't forget. Here we go. So follow, follow the sword on the wall. Nice. 
payday. My favorite candy ball. This game is getting funny. Swordsman Labyrinth, huh? Will make you look pretty, well, it's making me look pretty stupid. It wasn't a painting of a door, it was just a door to a wall. Who designed this place? Pretty funny. This was not the dungeon I was thinking of earlier. That one... I don't know what that's for, but it's in this game. There's walls that you walk on top of and you, you go around and it's, there's a lot of treasure in there. It's a great description of the dungeon, I'm sure. Everybody's very impressed. statue to that tile and the bridge should lower, correct? Zelda song. Do -do 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 -do.
is this, an accordion cut? Hey, an actual door! It leads to a new room. How about that? Oh, those have to align to meet up with a hole on the grid, something like that. Right. Alright, so it's one off from that corner. Here. Dragon Quest Heroes 3, they gotta have Yangus in it, right? Yeah. Yangus, they could have a, a separate, like, Torneco has his own, uh, what is it, on PlayStation? Japanese? There's, a, there's two of them. Something like that. Uh... I knew that. You could do that with Yangus, you know, him and Red, uh, before he meets up with the Gov, or before he uh, changes his ways, you know, Bandit Yangus, but nice Bandit Yangus, like, you know, Robin Hood, you know, that, you know, not bad, evil Yangus. Bad, evil, yeah, bad, evil. Trap box. This thing hits hard, but we should be just fine, right? Maybe we're not there yet? Hero's gonna wanna equip the lance. Am I gonna take over for Jessica? Probably. Yeah, I'll take over for Jessica. Have her. Mm. Angelo is going to... I don't know. What's he going to do? What's Angelo do this productive? Kabuff. 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 Kabuff at least once? I don't know if we can do it twice. Bingo. Alright. Trap box. Guess who's back? It is trap box, right? Yeah. Item. Holy lamp. We've used a lot of holy so far. I'm going to do that. And you are going to kabuff. And you are going to oom. Yangus. Probably should have oomped hero. Because Yangus is going to go afterwards anyways, right? Okay, the defense didn't drop. Does that mean it didn't work? Or it can't be done against trap bogs? Let's try it again. You're gonna do the same thing, and you are going to do shot. More kebab. Nah, 
Dad's defense can't be lowered with the helm split. Uh oh. Huh. We've got Tingle, right? Angelo can deal some damage, he's going to be really balanced. Venus tear. Jackpot. So this is it, eh? The Venus tear. You beauty. You know, Gov, last time I tried to get this done, I'd done it for red. Now we're just rivals, I guess. But I actually used to have a bit of a thing for Red. Back in them days, she wasn't a scary old bird like she is now. And I was well green. So, I thought I'd get her the Venus tear to impress her like. But I ended up doing myself an injury, and I had to leave it. Came in here by himself at level one? <laughs> wow. Never thought I'd end up getting it like this, though. He must have had some crazy gear. I wonder how it would have all turned out if I had got it back then, eh? Anyway, just me old wounds. Would you mind keeping this to yourself, Gov? Ain't the kind of thing you want going around. Mum's the word. Reds on our Zoom list? I don't think so. Okay, so this was to the north, so we go this way. Alright, so we get. We'll make the trade with Red. And she does uphold her end of the deal. I've got the Lancer Clip. Doesn't matter. Um, we get the horse back. And then we go back to Pico and talk to Brain. Who know who's heard something or knows something about Dolmegas. And then we need a boat. And how do, then brains comes into the equation then again. How do we learn about the boats?
Red is lazy. Couldn't she have just gotten that thing herself? Maybe she's not tough enough, but I doubt that. She could recruit some help. Dive down in there and get it. She's just either lazy or maybe she's not as badass as we thought she was. by the book the way you're supposed to which I never do don't go stealing in the metery before you talk to you know before you do the thieves guild line otherwise you can't do it so many bugs in there but it's still really good if I could play there I'll go it the is this is or Skyrim I think I'd Probably pick this game, but why even make that decision? When you can now play that is quality. Oh yes, this is the real deal. The real deal. Well, Yangus, you excel yourself. Now hand over the ocean cart like you promised. I never promised that. I said I'd think about it when you bought me the goods. And I've thought about it now, and I'm still not giving it back. You can keep the stone. Oi, that ain't what you promised. That's a pretty low trick, Red. I'm surprised at ya. Promises? You wanna talk about promises? If I remember rightly, you promised me ages ago you'd bring me that stone. What? That was years ago. You can't dredge up the past like that. Well, you're in no position to argue. I ain't saying it again. The horse stays with me. Yeah, right. I was out of line before, breaking me promise to you and all. I ain't surprised you're act off with me. Act off? What? But this ain't just about me now. I can't leave without the horse. It's for the guff. Look, do what you want with me. But I'm begging you, give the horse back. <laughs> hey? Yeah, no kidding. Oh. All right, all right. Behave, would ya? Stop groveling about on the floor. Be a man. Well, I wonder in the. Oh, I'd have a bit of fun with you, but you've lost DS it. the version, what, how do you yours. get her to join? Do what you want with it. Would it be now? I don't think it'd be now. It'd probably be after the other dungeon that you sailed to. But I'll be keeping that Venus tear. That's what we agreed, right? Yeah. Fair enough. Thanks, Red, and sorry about everything. Oh, for crying out loud. Pull yourself together. We're done here, right? So go on then. Hop it. Hop it. What did she say? Get out. Understood. All right. What about 
the cauldron. Where's Trode? Red told me to get the all set for you before you got here. Looks like she knew you'd come up with the goods. Ah, she must rate you. Oh dear, what a terrible ordeal you must have been through. I'm so sorry. I won't leave you alone again. Yeah, Trode. I'll never nice go parenting. to the pub like that again. I promise. Cool, blimey! Well, we're ready to leave whenever you are. What's our next destination? Pick them. Brains. How about trying brains again? Maybe the old geezer will be around to give us some intelligence this time. <laughs> Let's head back to pick them. We've got to find out where Dolmagus is. Here, look at their eyes. They're Otherwise, all at we'll Genghis. just be wandering around like headless chickens. Hmm. It will be no hardship to me if I never ever set foot in Pickham again. And I suppose we have no choice. Why is that guy waving? All of a sudden he likes us. What, Maury's Place stuff? We'll do that later. Let's go visit Brains. Like that line. Um, well, this guy, you know, he's a poet. He's a writer. And he's just laying down. And apparently, in some people's opinions, he'd be doing nothing. And it, even in his own opinion. But you know, like it, it was. I think it was John Hughes. Like laying down on the couch is working. Like he's he's working on ideas. There's another line I like, uh, with Brandon Sanderson. Uh, I think the best lecture I've ever seen in my life uh, on YouTube. And you know, don't, do you have an office? Because I don't need. He needs a writer, uh, as I'm sure you know. I go, do you have an office? Because I don't need an office. I have a couch and a laptop. <laughs> That guy's lectures are amazingly good. Not just the, I mean, it's the, the excitement and the back and forth. Everybody's on the same page. It's, if you like JRPGs, check out his lectures on YouTube. Uh, they're at BYU. And they've been taped, and I think you can just watch them ad free. Oh yeah, there's an old blind sage or something like that there. Yeah. Intelligent seed. Seed of wisdom, yeah, 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 it's brains. I remember that. 
You always remember that one. Let's read some of Brand's books. Also with uh, Sanderson, you know, all these JRPGs are works of fiction. It'll help you appreciate media better, as in how to produce it, uh, how to write it, uh, what the components are, what the process is, how to appreciate fiction better. Um, it's, it's right after that, I, I watched, you know, all those the beginning of the pandemic was been watched all of Sanderson and then played Final Fantasy X and it just it blew my mind. Hello, brains. Long time no see. Back at last, eh? Hello. Well, well, look who it is. You came when I was out, did you, Yangers? I'm sorry I wasn't here. No problem, mate. But you're back again. So, if I'm not mistaken, you must be in need of some information. Am I right? Right -o. Always on the ball, eh, Brains? We're looking for this bloke who looks, <laughs> looks like, like a clown. <laughs> Goes by the name of Don Magus. <laughs> looks like a clown. He's he a use the word jester. customer. Keeps getting away from us. Have you heard anything? Yes, I've heard about him. The criminal responsible for murdering the abbot of Maella Abbey, no less. My sources report seeing him walking over the surface of the sea toward the western continent. Okay, we need a boat, Brains. The western continent? That's a bit easy, isn't it? Can't you be more spiffic? Spiffic? <laughs> Sorry, that's all I know. I wish I could tell you more. I wonder how the Japanese voice acting is. I have I I've seen I have I don't know if I've seen a casual playthrough. And now, not of the Japanese version. Well, I want to hear. Yeah, I haven't even heard Yangus in the Japanese version. I don't think. But this, uh, whoever this voice actor is, just did a. a tr Nobody could have done a better job. Well, if you don't know nothing more, brains, there ain't nothing more to know. We'll have to go to the Western continent ourselves. A fine idea. But aren't you forgetting something? How do you intend to cross the sea? Oh, yeah, right. Forgot about that. We'll I... swim. Monster attacks at sea have been significantly worse recently. All crossings from here and from the northern continent have been cancelled. You could go if you had your own ship, but unless I'm misinformed, you don't. <laughs> I'd say that will pose quite a problem. I... yeah, you're right. Uh, yeah. I don't fault with that. No, I can see that. <laughs> well, perhaps I can help you out there with a little snippet of information I heard. Let's have it. Follow the cliffs along the coast to the west from Port Prospect, and you will come to a wide open wasteland. Oh, right. That was blocked off by the rock slide or the whatever. That's on the way to Trodane. So that opened up, and... According to what I hear, there's an old abandoned ship there. We just need to... get it working again. I don't know why a ship should be in a place devoid of water, but anyway, people say it's a magic ship. If you could get it up and running again, you'd be able to sail anywhere you wanted. Ishmari comes into play here. You might want to try the path to the west of Port Prospect. It was blocked by a rock slide. But I hear that's been cleared up now. This Brains is. Does Brains want to join the party? This guy's no. He's connected. This guy knows everything. He might be the most informed person on this planet. Uh, this DQ8 world. Besides Dolmagus, you know, Brains. This guy ought to come with. You know, his wisdom's got to be, you know, through the roof. He doesn't ever have to participate, but... Or, you know, have a little 
the walkie-talkie action with brains, so we don't have to come back to pick them. All right, so Port Prospect. And, you know what, we're gonna save. Save. Oh, hang on. Alchemy, right? Okay. We got it back. Is anything in there? Spicy. Cheesy. Let's just throw these in real quick. Uh, yeah. All right, so we're going to save at the chapel. I think we'll call it a segment here. And the next segment, we're going to Port Prospect. Trying to find that magic boat. That's the kind of place you buy like 10 gold rings or something like that. I mean, you don't, but I do. Buy as many as you can, and they've got so much. They've got like two of everything. You know, two weapon shops, two armorers, two item shops, Yggdrasil shop, food vendors. Anyways, we need a lot more money. Thanks for watching.